Hello everybody, welcome back to the next part of the Pack Legacy Challenge. And as you can see, I am in Cass. It only took 10 episodes, which is too much to say the least. But I quickly want to show you guys what I did with Donut because I changed his appearance quite a bit to kind of what I assumed he would look like. So here we have his everyday outfit. Here's their formal outfit. Sleepwear, party, swimwear, hot weather, and cold weather. And if we go down to his alien outfits, which are no longer those metal nappy, those metal diapers, they are more or less the same as his has their um, human disguise outfits. So there's that. I went through yesterday and changed the appearance of every single member of the Grimm family. So they should all be looking a million times better. I am recording this at the end of September. I know that it will probably be around the around like mid-October when this comes out. But I did record this a few weeks ago at this point. But let's jump into the video. My game is running so much smoother. It is so nice. I forgot to mention this in cast, but I did like quickly set. But Callum's likes and dislikes were set. And I uh, put his um, romantic and sexual in orientations back to what they should be. So he is a romantic so he doesn't see people in a romantic sense and he won't get jealous if his partner gets romantic with other sims but he will get jealous if they woohoo with other sims something else that i did in between episodes and this is the final thing i swear is i got the grimophone or the yeah the grimophone so we're just going to put that there. And even though these rewards have literally nothing to do with this generation, they are a limited time. So they are only here for a limited time. So we do have to work to get them. I think they end on uh, November 19th. So hopefully his spouse will be more interested in this stuff than we are. Meter socialize with the Grim Reaper. See, this is more something that I feel like the life and death sim would be good at, but we can't wait that long to do this. So we do only have $476 in the household. Um, yeah, we don't have a lot of money right now. So you introduced yourself. So now the last thing we need to do for this one is wait for the Ambrosia Society newsletter. Oh, you are stinky. Okay, so in the morning you are going to have to get a bath. Why don't you remove your disguise before you go to bed? Okay, you're both up. So what we're going to do... Oh, shit, the baby woke you up. So you're going to give Donut a bubble bath. And then you are going to nap before work. See, now you're tired. So why don't you come and take a nap before you have to go to daycare? But honestly, Donut looks so cute now. And they honestly look how I pictured them when I first made them. So that's good. We have a few hours before work today. And I think the only thing we really need to do is make sure Donut puts on his uh, their disguise. And then seriously, get nap. You have to go into daycare. Oh wow, that cut it real close, Callum. That cut it real close. I will be joining you at work today because I do not trust you to go into work by yourself anymore. After what happened last time. Daily experimentation. Great. So, again, 
I forgot to bring the satellite dish. Can I make an embiggen serum? Something tells me I can't. Embiggen, I need a plantain and an apple. I have neither of those. Today is going to be a long work day. You Simray on tourist. Oi. When we get home, I'm going to put the satellite dish in my inventory so that tomorrow I can bring it into work. Watch, I'm going to bring it into work and I won't need to upgrade it. But still. So Kiri, where are you? Everyone's bold. Because I have several hairs that broke my game, so I didn't put them back in. Kiri, there you are. I would like to give you an untested serum. Oh, yay. You're a ghost. Holly, mind control, sit. Oh, dear. This is going to be a long work day. Order coworker to clean. Perfect. My coworkers are going to hate me. Read a book. Read Orbital Pudding. I know how to read a book. Seriously though, I do need to put the satellite dish in my inventory when I get home. Because I can't just leave that. And that's it. We're done. So we're going to observe the sky for the rest of the day. Actually, what we're going to do is we're going to shower and then observe the sky. And then we're going to take a nap. So we are a little bit tired today, which is fine. But now we are focused and we're going to spend the next few hours in this telescope or the observatory, whatever it's called. Trying to get another print for the bakery. Okay, we have another space print, which is good. And we're also exhausted. So it's going to be a rough night. But we got 2,600 simoleons. No promotion today. But we still have tomorrow. And we are getting close to that promotion too. So... It shouldn't be too long now. Uh, use the bathroom. How are your needs? Your needs are phenomenal, actually. And then, go to sleep. Oh, let's look at the new print. Oh, that is so cool. It's not really space-themed. But you know what? It's pretty damn cool. I'm actually going to go into build mode really quickly. Put this and the household inventory in. I need to get the Ravachine collage because I had to add that back in separately. And we're going to add those there. I don't know why that's freaking out like that, but it shouldn't because they're fine where they are. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to add this one. You know what, I was going to put this on the brick here, but the game really just does not want me to put it, put this over here. I guess I need to shrink it down a little bit, but yeah, there, we're going to put that there. We have our collage, our family collage, which is great. Oh my gosh, what the heck, I forgot I put that there. We're going to put this in your inventory because we apparently need to upgrade it at work. And then hopefully we have some leftovers that aren't spoiled. Okay, this light is very intense. Hold up. First of all, auto lights, all lights. On all lights so I could like set intensity. And then you're like, you need to be like white. I don't know why you were yellow before, but you're not yellow. I do want to make a goal of myself to not use the tiny saucer lights. What are you doing, Belladonna? You have a grandbaby who wants to spend time with you. 
You're kind of just like disassociating, aren't you? Level 2 movement, great. We're still having a few technical difficulties, but overall the game is running much smoother than it used to. And apparently I need to put a nightlight in Callum's room because he's afraid of the dark. I think I'm going to wake you up now before everyone gets too hungry to function. Mom, I love having you here, but it is, in fact, 3.30 a.m., so can you please go home to your wife and your almost twin daughters, please? Because I can guarantee you those girls are going to need you in the morning a lot more than I do. So, now that your preferences are actually working, what are some things you like and dislike? You like fitness, rocket science, gardening, baking, but you dislike fishing. And you like alternative music and new age music. Great. Speaking of, listen to alternative music. Reached baking level 7. Perfect, 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 perfect. We haven't actually done a lot of baking in our adult life. I remember we were actually at um, level 6 when we moved out. Wait, is Shepherd's Pie vegetarian? <laughs> Oh wow, I just completely glossed over the fact that Shepherd's Pie is not vegetarian. I guess that one's going to donuts. Because Callum is a vegetarian. Yeah, I know you don't feel good. Alright, we need to put in some money. 500 simoleons to the Astro Bakery. So you are hungry. So what we're going to do is we're going to open this and you are going to get the shepherd's pie. Because your dad's not going to eat this. But I forgot that Callum was a vegetarian. Wow. Okay. When you get back, you're going to have to bathe Donut. Because he's practically vibrating for a bath. And then take a nap before work although you might not have time join we're going to go to work today with our satellite dish so we can finally upgrade it watch we don't need to upgrade it today yep don't need to upgrade it all right daily experimentation let's go let's go oh shoot i forgot to put Donuts disguise up. Uh, upgrade Simray with sleep. My controller coworker just said I don't have it in my inventory. Mint synthetic food serum. I think I can make that. Yeah, I need to plant. Alright, let's get going. I can actually do things now, which is fantastic. I said earlier that this video was going to come out in mid-October, and that made me realize that I've been making videos for this series for almost a year. For this series came out on Halloween of 2023, which is wild. And for a while it was just one video a week, but since May I've been doing three videos every two weeks which has made this go by a lot faster although I have enjoyed every single moment of this challenge I think part of the reason why this challenge is so exciting is because each generation brings something completely different to the table and honestly I just think Rosanna did an amazing job making this legacy challenge even if it was just like basing it off of EA's packs. But that's enough of me babbling on about how much I love this challenge because I feel like I've done that a few times now. There's always something to look forward to. So we should be pretty much done with our work day. Which means we can take a power nap and observe the sky. Are you learning skills at daycare? Oh, mm, I don't think you are. I think the... I need to check if the education overhaul bundle 
was uh, causing some of the issues. But if it wasn't, then I definitely want to put that back into the game because that really just adds something to the game, you know? What the fuck do you mean? Fine. Just now for the rest of the day. Callum's workday will end in one hour. We're actually leaving at seven, which is nice. Why don't you try and do a little bit of stargazing? You don't have to do a lot, but we can still try. Um, yeah. Twenty-one hundred dollars. We actually do make quite a bit of money from this. What I'm thinking is, before we retire to run our bakery, we're going to use up all those vacation days and get all of the money from those. And you are absolutely trashed, so why don't you take a shower? Okay, why don't you grab some leftovers first? Get leftovers and then go to sleep, because you are... So dead to the world. Boogie Downer. What? From dancing to music. If the dancing is soon cease, the tears might soon release. Actually, don't go to sleep. Belladonna Grimm would like to come over. Is that okay? Mom? Yes, you can come over. Please come over. Bath. Give my child a bath, please, because... Because I am about to pass out, and I need like five minutes. She's gonna say, don't worry kid, I totally get it. I'm on the- I can watch Donut for the night. I love that Belladonna is helping us with Donut even though she has two daughters at home. This is cute. This is really cute. Movement level three. Fantastic. Donut has had a lot of grandma time this episode, which I think is really nice. I mean, sure, they know their dad is will always be there to help them, but he is also incredibly busy, so he can't always be there. And I'm also looking at the work performance and thinking that uh, on Monday will be when we get the next promotion, which isn't great, but we'll live. And I'm thinking there's going to be a sort of the, like a time lapse episode where I build the bakery. But we have Belladonna reading to Donut to bed. Reading to Donut to bed. I stand by that. Because it is time to go to bed, even if. The kid is not tired in any way, shape, or form. And Grandma's just going to stay in the house, because that's what she does. And there she goes. There she goes. And these two get to sleep in today, because neither of them have anything going on. And Donut, it is time for your daily shepherd's pie. Because Sim God forgot your father was a vegetarian. Is it wrong to want to cheat this aspiration? Right, because us owning a rocket ship is very slim. Because that's like 10k. But I feel like we've already completed the last part of the aspiration. And now we're at something that is a lot more manageable. <laughs> Should I have done that? No, probably not. But at the same time, I don't really care. Why don't we go over to our mom's place? That way Donut can meet his aunts, Columba and Clem, who are now children. So why don't we travel with Donut? to Belladonna's house or to our childhood home because we all finally have a break in our schedule to go and see these guys 
I kept Columba's hair because it wasn't bad. And when I say bad, I mean it wasn't glitching out. I might give her a little bit more of a makeover later, but I literally spent like two hours yesterday in Cass giving everyone makeovers. So we're going to end it there for now. Hello, Chase. Donut, come here and meet Columba. And meet Chase while you're at it. Talk to stranger. Where's Clem? Oh, Clem is up here with Farah, who is blue because we froze her yesterday. Talk to stranger. She's your grandmother. I will say a lot of this CC that Farah and Belladonna had did in fact disappear. It did in fact leave while I was fixing my mods, but I did try and give them more elderly appearances while still keeping their vibes. Actually, you don't know your sisters that much either. Or did I cheat that? Because it was kind of dumb that you didn't know your sisters. I think I cheated it. I do think I cheated it, but that's fine. Because now everybody knows everybody and everybody is friends. It is still funny to me that Donut is close... To that uh, the girls are closer in age to Donut than Callum. I keep forgetting that Farah has the mean trait. Oh, I gotta like build this up. Chase is also here helping to look after the girls because let's face it, Farah and Belladonna are gonna die before these two become teenagers, so. Oh, look at these three. They're so cute. And they still don't know that Donut is an alien. You know what? I think it might be time to go home. Because things are kind of tense here. Closer from happy memories. That's lovely. You know more family members now, which is perfect. You know your aunt specifically. But that was a lovely day. Meeting up with the farms. And it is time to go into build mode and add a little more to the house. First I'm going to turn lights. Turn all lights on so I can see. But we are going to add a little more to the house. Probably a computer. I think that's the safest thing to add first. Can I add some blue with this desk? Yes, I can. Okay, perfect. So we have a little bit of an office space here. I'm thinking, let's put the space prints that we got in here for now, and then bring them into the bakery once we get it up and running. Now for this wall. Oh boy. Alright, so I did a little bit of work in the mostly dining room area. I added some wall decor, some spacings. I got this uh, print that we got at work. And I even put some artwork up that Donut made, which is exciting. And then I'm just going to quickly break the fourth wall here and go into here because I slightly decorated the office. I put this space. I slightly decorated the office with some of the stuff that we're going to decorate the bakery with. Um, keeping with this orange and blue theme. And then I switched the rug out in here with this, uh, I think it's from Little Campers Kit 1, which has this beautiful rocket ship swatch on it. The final thing I did was I just quickly put an aromantic flag in Callum's room because you gotta have that pride showing because you gotta be prideful about who you are and that's kind of it I didn't do a lot today I still want to fill in this space here but we don't really have a reason to fill this space in quite yet I'm kind of going with a suburban meets uh, outer space vibe going on. 
which is proving interesting to make. I am going to end this episode here with Donut ripping a fat one in front of Callum. If you enjoyed, then make sure to leave a like. And if you are interested in the story of these two, then consider subscribing. It is free and you can always leave if you decide you do not want to stay. But with all that out of the way, I will see you all in the next video. Auf Wiedersehen, everybody.